This is a tutorial for the TI Innovator Hub and the TI Inspire CX Series Calculator. This tutorial is aligned with the free 10 minutes of coding lessons available from the Texas Instruments website. In this session, we see how loops can be used to generate a rainbow of colours using the RGB diode, introduced in Skill Builder 2 of Unit 1. In the 1600s, Isaac Newton demonstrated that white light could be broken up into different colours, and that the reverse is also true. He established the three primary colours of light, red, green and blue, from which all colours can be made. Through the combination of refraction, reflection and dispersion, we see rainbows, starting at the top with red, blending through to green, which is where we will start our program. Connect the TI Innovator Hub to your calculator. Start a new document and new program. I'll call my program Color2. To get the RGB diode to automatically fade from red to green, we will need a loop. From the control menu, select the for loop. The RGB diode accepts brightness levels from 0 through to 255. Now that the loop structure is set up, select the send set color command. As the loop counter I starts at 0 and goes up to 255, we need the opposite to occur for the red value. So we need to evaluate the expression 255 minus I. At the same time that the red brightness is decreasing, our green brightness needs to be increasing. We can do this by just evaluating I. In our first colour transition, we don't want any blue, so we can set that value to zero. We're now ready to run the first section of our code, so press Control R then enter. The first part of our rainbow is complete. Now we need a second loop, one that will transition from green into blue. This is very similar to our first loop, so I'm going to highlight the previous loop by holding down the shift key and selecting. I'll copy it and paste it immediately below the first loop. With a simple bit of editing, I can set red to zero and delete the zero that corresponded to blue at the end of the color statement. And I'm done. Press Control R and run. Our RGB diode starts at red, transitions to green, and then from green, transitions to blue, just like a real rainbow. Except we could add some violet in. To do that, you'll need to think about which colour you will need to add and how much. If you're not sure of the colour mix, you can use a range of drawing programs to help. That's all for this tutorial. In the next tutorial, you'll see how to run through the music scales. Subscribe to our channel to receive updates as new tutorials are added to this series. Thanks for watching.